also on this holiday week, what is better than this? The sound of a child splashing. Well, this one just 16 months old, a championship swimmer across a pool in Texas, a kind of Olympian. But even the strongest swimmers have reason to be cautious because drowning is the leading cause of accidental death for children under five. And tonight, ABC's Lindsay Davis wants to show us something new. Keep an eye on the little boy in blue. Watch as he slips under the surface without warning, vanishing immediately, a parent's nightmare. But now picture this, a device that can actually warn you when your child's in trouble. This is a Wahoo swim band. It's worn over the forehead, and when submerged for 20 seconds, it sends out a signal. These lights start flashing yellow. After 30 seconds, it sounds the siren. For kids, it's just like putting on a pair of goggles. So how did it feel swimming having that on? It doesn't really affect how you swim. Yeah. It's just there. For adults, it's a cutting edge safety upgrade. The new Canaan, Connecticut YMCA paid $30,000 to install the system in this pond, just the sixth installation anywhere in the world. Why did you feel that a lifeguard wasn't enough? You're only as good as your best lifeguard who's having a bad day. Watch, even in a clear swimming pool, how the movement blurs the presence of a swimmer. In murky water like a pond, it's even more dramatic. Look how this bright yellow dummy just vanishes. For decades, the best way to find a lost swimmer was to form a rescue line, sweeping the area step by step. But now lifeguards can pinpoint a swimmer with this locator. I was a lifeguard back in 1980 was when I went through my training. And hardly and anything has changed since then. Absolutely. Safety experts call this device a game changer. It gives you the ability to learn very quickly that you have someone in trouble and it gives you the ability to locate them very quickly. Technology that not only saves time, but could save lives. Lindsay Davis, ABC News, New Canaan, Connecticut.